Hello, this is uh, Tim from ReadyMade RC, if you don't know me already. Um, just wanted to give you all a quick tour of the new uh, facility. Um, really excited, uh, been growing. Um, we're able to move from the house to another warehouse and expand it a couple times. And here we are and moving into a new uh, larger warehouse, uh, less than a year and a half after I uh, moved to the first one. So uh, thanks to everyone for your support. Um, so uh, we're going to start out from outside. Um, this is the, uh, the new building. Um, got a unit here. Um, just to kind of give you a look, uh, some area we're going to uh, do some product testing and uh, areas we'll be able to fly here. Uh, nice open field for now. We'll see how long it lasts and development will come in there. But yeah, we'll, we'll use it while we can. Here's the, uh, the main entrance. This is where our customer pickup is going to be. And uh, we're going to have a counter here, uh, some a uh, few displays, but uh, not really a showroom, more just uh, meant for customer pickup. This uh, actually used to be a conference room, but hey, I'm going to take it as an office. Why not, right? Um, going to uh, be my office. Uh, kind of our main area. Don't really have uh, specific plans for this area, except maybe to test some small, uh, small microcopters and some other things that we're working on. Uh, this area is going to be where we're going to do a uh, majority of our product testing, uh, you know, uh, any repairs. Uh, it has electrostatic uh, dissipative uh, floors, um, so help to protect the electronics. Um, sorry if the camera's shaky here, I'm just holding the GoPro. Um, future uh, room for offices and uh, possibly receptionists at some point. Another office. This, uh, this is where we're going to be doing most of our, most of our order packing. The majority of our items are going to be in here. Um, we're actually adding a second shipping station. So we'll have two uh, parallel shipping, shipping stations in here so we can keep up with everything. Um, kind of a semi-enclosed area off the main dock. It's all climate controlled. So we'll be comfortable. Everything is going to be kept in good shape. And this is really the, the big plus. Uh, just a great huge storage space here. We, uh, we have lots of room for expansion and that's really the plan. We're going to try to carry lots of new stuff, add more planes, um, keep uh, getting the things everyone wants. Here's uh, some more space we're going to be able to fly from back here. Uh, there's the, uh, the ready-made RC trailer. Just recently got that. So lots of room back here. Uh, Lots of room for expansion. We, uh, we actually hope to do some flying of some smaller models in here. May even, uh, if we can figure out a way to do it, come up with maybe do a small uh, kind of an open house uh, fly-in for indoor stuff. We're thinking about it. Um, in there, there's another office, another room. We're going to have some uh, our CNC router and some other things, other things installed. Here's the uh, dirty corner of the warehouse, apparently. And we actually have a break room. Uh, it's kind of a shift from uh, eating, eating where we also test the electronics. So actually good to have a, a, a real break room in here. And now we've uh, kind of come back around to the larger room up uh, front. And that's it. A uh, little bright colors there. I tried to match the ready-made RC colors. I think it turned out all right, pretty bright. Um, but anyway, that's... Uh, just a quick, uh, quick view there. Uh, we're pretty excited. Um, really want to thank everyone. We're just, just amazed that we've gotten to where we are here, um, that we're able to be in this place, and how fast we've gotten here. And I want to thank the customers. Hope you continue to support us, and we're going to continue to support you. And uh, thanks again.